I'm going to show you how you can share a public link for individual Airtable records. I'll be using this tool by many extensions.com. So the idea is you want to, you know, send some records to some people and you want to get this unique URL. Each record gets a unique URL. You can send a single record to the person. They can look at it. It looks nice. It has full support for all of the Airtable field types, link records, you know, attachments, single select, multi-select, the whole thing. And optionally, you get to choose if you want to allow them to edit it. And if they can edit it, you get to choose what specifically of the record they can edit. So you can choose exactly what fields they can edit. And when they edit, the editor is actually super fast and has support for everything. And as you can see, as soon as I clicked save, this got updated. So pretty much live editing, super fast, full support for all the Airtable field types. I'll show you how you would set this up now. So start by filling up your user API key and then select your base and then select your table. Then I'll choose the um, fields I'd like the users to be able to see. This can be a subset of my fields or all of them up to us. In my case, I'm going to choose all the fields. Then after that, you, if you'd like to have a title for each card, you can choose a field to make that title. Or if you'd like to also have a cover image, that's, that was the cover image you saw on top, you can choose a field for that as well. And then optionally, if you want to allow your users to edit, you can enable this and then choose which fields they can edit. And like I said, this could be a totally different subset of fields totally up to you. So in my case, I'm just going to add a couple, then I'll click Save. As you can see, I get a formula. I'll want to copy this formula, and then I want to add this formula to my table as a new field. And what this will do is it will generate a unique URL for each one of my records. So I'll say, you know, single record URL. And this record, uh, th this um, URL will now, every time, just be linking to a single record because of that record ID in that URL. So as you can see, I can open this and I can you know just open any of these and they'll show me that specific record.